This is the original file. What I do to change the speed, I go down to the timeline and I right click on the file. When the window pops up, I select speed duration. I change it to 70%. This is 70%. It's not very slow. So then I change it to 20%. It's, it's a little bit jerky, but this is the best you can do. So now let's change the look of it to get it away from the home video-ish feel. Go up to the project window and select the effects tab. Click on video effects, then go down and select adjust. Click and hold down on brightness and contrast and drag to the effect controls tab. When you get it there, you can adjust it. This is what it looks like after I did my tweaking. So then if you go back to the effects tab to the left, if you go down to image control and you open up that one, there's a lot of little color tools in there. I, my favorite one is color balance RGB. So I select that and I drag it over, tweak some colors, add some cool music, and this is what I got. In the timeline window, if there's a red bar near the top, chances are your video plays jerky after adding effects. Simply select the timeline window and press enter and allow it to render. This way you'll be able to see a smooth version of what your final effect will look like.